So today we're going to take a look at the Sierra Designs Flex Trail 40 to 60 litre backpack. So I haven't seen any videos on this pack yet. So I've been using this for a few weeks now. So I thought I'd show you some of its features and let you know what my early thoughts on it are. So straight off the bat, probably the best feature of this pack is that it's expandable from anywhere between 40 and 60 litres. So you can alter the capacity by loosening or tightening these straps. Although it says 40 to 60, the range is actually 39 litres to 56 litres, but that still gives you a lot of coverage when it comes to choosing your gear over different scenarios and seasons. So I've got a couple of other Sierra Designs packs. I've got the Flex Capacitor, the 40 to 60 and the 60 to 75. And where this pack differs is the way that it expands and the stretchy pocket. So you don't have one of these on the Flex Capacitor. And also the pockets in the side, these are absolutely huge. So this is a one and a half litre water bottle. Almost swallows it. On this side, I managed to get a two person tent in there. I don't normally carry my shelters in the side pockets, but I just wanted to show you just how big and deep these are. And then you've got the stretchy pocket in the back where you can put your waterproofs. Look at that, got a tent in. So it gives you loads of options when it comes to storing your gear. Right, let's get them out of the way. So a lot of backpacks you normally have to buy in small, medium, large, whereas this one's got a fully adjustable um, shoulder strap. So let me show you how that works. Just pop this, so it's like a little locking carabiner. Just pop that off and then just slide it in to whichever one suits your torso length. Means you can dial it in for the perfect fit. And um, the hip belt as well, that's, I think it goes from anywhere between a 31 inch waist and a 54 inch waist. So that covers most eventualities anyway. It's got the adjustable sternum strap. You can slide that up and down on there as well. There's two oversized pockets in there on the hip belt. You could easily get your mobile phone in there. Some snacks. So there's a thick padded lumbar support there, um, padding across the shoulder blades, thick padding around the hip belt. It's really comfortable to wear. Um, and this pack carries the load really well. So everything goes down to the hips. It's got an internal um, frame that goes around the outside, which is aluminium alloy. So the bag is made from a mixture of 150 denier polyester ripstop, and then some of these harder wearing areas. This is a 420 denier, so very durable. The chunky zip, which is very free moving as well. So I actually prefer this zip to the one on the flex capacitors that I've got. Opens all the way up the top there. You can just see the aluminium frame under there. Look, not too much stuff in. There is also a pocket here where you can clip on your water bladder and there's a little hole for your bladder to come through there, look. On the front, we have another pocket in here. Keep your little wood stove or pegs, anything that you want to get access to pretty quickly. The shoulder straps, have adjustable load lifters. But the expandability has got to be the killer feature for me. Brilliant. So this means now that you can, if you want to, get away with one pack instead of two sometimes. So in winter, you need to take a little bit more gear with you sometimes. And you, you might need that 58, 60 litres. Whereas in the summer, you can cinch it all down because you're taking less gear. But I've just opened that up there and now the tent just slots down the side. You can see that the 
the load spreads out um, across rather than, you know, on some other packs where the, the load just goes upwards, so it makes it a bit less comfortable to carry. Um, this is really comfortable to carry when it's fully loaded. You can always then just cinch everything down so there's nothing moving around in your pack. I believe it only comes in this colour. Um, it's around the £150 price mark, which makes it a very affordable pack. It's cheaper than the Osprey Exos, um, and it also weighs less than the Exos. So the Osprey Exos weighs 1.3 kilos, and this is 1.23. So you've got a lighter pack that's got either greater or larger capacity, depending on your needs. I actually like this more than my older flex capacitors just because of the pockets on it are superb. The newer version of the flex capacitor, I think it's got, well I know it's got some pockets down here so you can shove um, jackets in, things like that. One thing that I would like to add to this, which I am going to buy an aftermarket one, is bottle pockets, but it's a feature that I like to have on a backpack now. But you can pick them up for around a tenner. So that's what I'll do. So that's just a quick look at the Sierra Designs Flex Trail 40 to 60. Very versatile bit of kit because you can adjust the volume. It's also incredibly comfortable. It's really well made and it's affordable. I'll leave a link in the description where you can pick one of these up and find a bit more information. But that's it for this one. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.